Talking prep, Springdale football, Zach Clark, kind enough to join us this morning. Coach, congratulations. Your Bulldogs are ranked undefeated, and you got to enjoy an off week last week. Yeah, no doubt. Um, you know, it was good. It was a good week for us. Uh, we were able to do some, you know, some different things that, that uh, you know, we haven't hit since fall camp. And, uh, you know, bye week came. I, we liked it. I think the kids enjoyed it. And, um, you know, looking forward to getting into conference play. Before we talk about conference play, let's go ahead and look at the top ten. Came out this week, Springdale, number eight in the state. It's been a while since the Bulldogs were ranked. You were ranked last week. Nice to see the Bulldogs in the top ten, isn't it? Oh, it, I mean, sure, it's 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 nice, but uh, at this point, it doesn't it, you know doesn't really mean much. Um, we don't talk about rankings at all with the with the kids. Uh, you know, we just try to. You know, take care of business, and, and by no means are we there yet. I think, uh, and, and I've told the kids this: we have potentially um, we we've got a chance for this to be a special year. And, and I think the talent or athleticism, um, and I think the way the kids work, it, it's certainly there in front of us. But uh, there's certainly things that we have to clean up, and and uh, we're a long ways of being uh, where we want to be. Yeah, no doubt. As we look at the schedule, three and zero. We hadn't talked since the win over Alma, thirty-seven to three. I know you had some concerns going into that one, but it looked like the team handled it all pretty well. We did. Uh, you know, the game went especially defensively. We played really well uh, throughout the entire game, and um, it, that was encouraging. We needed a, a great effort. Offensively, we really we played well. Uh, you know, felt like we played well the entire game. The problem was, uh, you know, we went in very fortunate to be up at halftime. They should have been behind uh, for the third week in a row and uh, had another couple of touchdowns called back because of penalties and, and getting into conference. We have to, um, we have to get rid of the self-inflicted uh, major, major, um, you know, penalties that, that have called uh, taking points off the board. So uh, really moved the ball even in the first half and, and just had, uh, you know, had three or four critical penalties um, or mistakes, that, you know, not just penalties, but uh, came out in the third quarter and, and really played well in all phases. Uh, I don't think, you know, I think Alma had uh, three, three and outs, three or four, three and outs. They didn't get a first down and, um, yeah, I think we scored three, three or four touchdowns. So, so anyway, it was encouraging um, that third quarter. But if, if we can play as clean as we did uh, in that third quarter and find some way to, you know, string a game together, uh, I think this team can be very, very dangerous. Kind of unusual to have a bye week going into the conference opener. What did you work on last week? Well, we, you know, really it was a it was a big week for fundamentals. Uh, it was a big week for, you know, the handful of two-way guys, the, the primary defensive guys that got to play offense and, and vice versa. Uh, I, I felt like we expanded on some packages. And then, um, you know, really got better at situations. We messed up a two-minute drill. Uh, so we, we finished practice three straight weeks with a, with a two-minute drill. Uh, kind of our, our field goal special teams um, organization and, and, and procedures. Um, really, our kick coverage units uh, need to be a lot better. And, and, and so, you know, we work those uh, every day, really had a, um, a productive week that uh, and, and we're able to, to rest some guys up, hopefully get some guys back uh, this week. And, and uh, you know, so overall, I mean, we, we loved it. I thought it was very beneficial. Conference play, you open against Heritage. What do you expect Friday night? They're they're extremely well coached. They play hard, um, and they you know really like their quarterback. They're very physical. Uh, the thing that I thought uh, that I think we've got a we've got a big advantage in is our overall team speed. And, and they, you know you look at the weather; that's a concern. I think it's uh, calling for for rain a lot of it, and um, so we'll have to adjust on the fly. That's, but that's scary. You know, that could, uh, that could neutralize, uh, you know, maybe our big advantage, but, uh, you know, had a, had a couple of delays uh, a couple of weeks ago and, and I thought our kids handled it well and, and we're 
looks like we're going to have to do the same this Friday. Well, Coach, appreciate the time. Best of luck, and we will catch up with you next week. You bet. Thanks, Blair. Thank you.